Today in math, we are going to analyze and compare our flat 2D shapes. So let's go over their names and then I'll describe them and you'll try to pick which shape is the shape I'm describing. All right, let's start out. What shape is this? Hexagon. Hex means six. If hex means six, how many sides does it have? Six. How many vertices does it have? Six. Here is our hexagon. Right there. All right, what shape is this? Triangle. What does tri mean? Tri means three. So triangle has three sides and three vertices. The vertices are the corners. It's our triangle. Next. What shape is this? Circle. A circle special because it has no straight sides and no vertices. It is just one round shape. Next is square. A square is special because all of the sides are equal. They're all the same size, all the same length. So a square has four sides, four vertices. And all of the sides are equal. All right, next one. Rectangle. A rectangle special because it has two short sides, two long sides. It also has four vertices and four sides like a square, but the difference is that a square has four equal sides and a rectangle has two sides that are short and two sides that are long. So I'm going to describe some shapes and you will guess which one they are. Okay, let's see. I'm thinking of a shape that has four sides, but the four sides are not all the same. Hmm, a shape that has four sides, that would be our square and rectangle, and the sides are not all the same. Which one is it? Rectangle, because a rectangle has two sides that are short and two sides that are long. Here's another one. I'm thinking of a shape that has no vertices. Hmm, which shape has no vertices? The vertices are the corners. Which shape has no vertices? Circle. All right. I'm thinking of a shape that has, excuse me, I'm thinking of a shape that has three flat sides. Hmm, which one has three flat sides? Triangle. Triangle, because tri means three. I'm thinking of a shape that has six vertices. Which shape has six vertices? What means six? Hex means six. So a hexagon has six vertices. All right. Last one. I'm thinking of a shape that has four equal sides. Square. A square has four equal sides. So now I want you to get your Envisions Volume 2 and go to page 510. And you'll have your helper read you the instructions and it will tell you exactly what to do. So for instance, number one says, have students listen to the clues, mark an X on the shape that does not fit the clue. Draw a circle around the shape that the clue describes. Then tell how the shape that they mark with an X are different from the other shapes they drew. So you will be explaining to your helper why the shapes are different from the other ones. So the first one it says, I have four sides. I do not have four sides that are the same length. What shape am I? So if I'm looking at this one, I have four sides. That would be a square rectangle. But the sides are not all the same. So that would be a rectangle. So you would circle rectangle and cross out all the ones that would not, that do not fit the description of a four-sided shape with sides that are not all the same. And then you're going to tell your helper why a rectangle is different than one of the shapes over here. So I would say a rectangle is different from a circle because 
a rectangle has vertices and straight sides and a circle has none. That would be a difference. And then you'll continue with the clues. There's one that's a little bit weird that I don't like, so I'll read it to you. It's number four here. And number four says, hold on, not number four, number five, sorry. It says, I have four vertices. I am a special kind of rectangle because my sides are all the same length. Um, we didn't talk about how squares can be rectangles. So when it has the clue here, um, helpers just for number five say, I have four vertices and all of the sides are the same length. And then they will pick which shape is has four vertices and all of the sides are the same. And then you'll go to the next page and do six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. All right, so follow the directions. You guys are my shape experts. And now it is your turn.